Earth Week, it's in full swing. Hopefully you're wearing green. A uh, commercial fishing crew out there in Santa Cruz, they're making sure they're environmentally conscious here while also keeping their business afloat. KION Morning anchor Anna Terea, she went out to check the crew out doing just that. When I think about sustainable fishing, it kind of starts at the top. It starts with the fishermen. You know what I mean? Like me and David love the ocean. We have a great long-term relationship with the ocean, so we want to do everything we can. Although we are commercial fishermen, we want to preserve the ocean. We're not the typical commercial fishermen, you know, but we definitely try to show everybody how you can do it. How does the friendliest catch crew? Put it in the claw. Oh, took it. There we go. Make sure they're being eco-friendly while also running a business. And all our equipment is electric, you know, so we are trying to use everything that's the most efficient and the best for the environment, you know, from our four-stroke outboard motor, our crab puller. You know, that's a, a high speed, you know, really good crab puller, but it's electric. Part of doing sustainable fishing is also using recycled bait. Like this bait here came from H&H &H Fish Market here in Santa Cruz. They then take this out to catch the crab in this bucket. Just drop it right here. Rockhold also started sharing his ocean adventures on TikTok. You know, we do this thing called the Barnacle Chronicles, and we basically give this crab a little bit of relief, and then we send it home. So you can take the pliers and everything we encounter out there, you know, we get to share it with our, our um, following. So it's, re it's really fun. And they don't just catch crab. They also catch fish like halibut. But those aren't the only sea creatures getting caught in their pod. An octopus. How cool is this guy? Yeah, we were all dating. All right, put him back. Rockhold says there are many challenges that face commercial fishermen, but believes that sustainable fishing is the future. I feel like the way we fish and what we represent is kind of the future of, of commercial fishing. I really feel like, you know, being sustainable, um, going far and beyond and being humane, you know, I really feel like it's the future. It's the future of fishing. Reporting in Santa Cruz, Anna Torreya, KION, News Channel 46. Now Rockhold tells KION they're working with Monterey Bay Fishery Trust, trying to figure out how to encourage more fishermen out there to use sustainable fishing methods.